today I'll be giving you a quick tutorial showing you how you can change the resolution of your iMovie project. So if you look into the settings section on the right, it you will see at the top right here the project resolution. But for some reason in iMovie, whatever you do, you can't change this. Like it's stuck on 1080p for the entire length of the project, no matter what clips you have. And the reason for this is because iMovie chooses the resolution based on the first clip that you import into the project. So there's a really simple way to change the resolution. Let's say you want to change it to 4K. Simply go to Google Images and look for a, uh, just look for a 4K image. Really, it doesn't matter what the image is. You just have to make sure uh, that it's 4K. So yeah, this one's good. And then you just like download it to your files. And once you grab it from the downloads, where do we put it? Here we go. Oh, that's not 4K. Okay, so here we go. This is a 4K image right here we bring it into our project, you have to make sure that you put it as the first clip in your project. And it, it literally doesn't matter what you have after that clip, just make sure you put it in first. And then all you have to do is grab the entire project, go up to edit and click cut. Don't worry, this won't delete your project because you simply have to click paste right after that. And now when we look in the settings, it's a 4K project. You can do the same thing with a 1080p image. So here, let's just see if I have a 1080p image already. Okay, there we go. This is a 1080p image. We just make sure we place it as the first file or the first clip in our project. Select everything, edit cut, and then edit paste the project returns and look at that all of a sudden it's back to 1080p at 60 fps you can do this with any resolution of image or video or any clip like that so you can go to 720p or 360p or re really you know whatever you want so if you have any more questions about this just feel free to put them in the comment section down below but I really hope this helped because I was having a lot of trouble with it for a long time, but I found that this solution worked. So I hope this helped you guys out and I'll see you in the next video.